And the South Dakota Supreme Court today took up a case involving a big name actor whose blockbuster film enjoys strong ties with the state. In the 90s, Kevin Costner had hoped to build the Dunbar Resort north of Deadwood, but this never happened and the sculptures planned for it are at the heart of this legal dispute. Costner and artist Peggy Detmers had an oral agreement that she would make bison sculptures to be on display at the entrance to the resort. Detmer started work on the sculptures in 1994, but by the late 90s, the Dunbar was not built. Because of this, she stopped her work. The sculptures eventually went on Costner-owned property that the actor had planned for the resort. The name of this display was Tatanka. Detmers in 2008 brought legal action against Costner. A trial court said that Detmers and Costner were in agreement to put the sculptures at Tatanka. Over 10 years ago, a court ruled that Mr. Costner had fully satisfied the contractual obligation that Ms. Detmers based her current lawsuit on. She cannot now resurrect that satisfied obligation or ask this court to impose new obligations not within that contract itself. Costner eventually sold all property around Tatanka. He also listed the Tatanka's land for sale in late 2021. The listing did not include the sculptures, but it did say the seller would move them. Costner unequivocally stating that he's going to relocate the sculptures would be a repudiation of that implied contract, and we can treat that as a breach. In November 2021, Detmers alleged the real estate listing, as well as a statement about moving the sculptures, represented a rejection of the deal to permanently have them at Tatanka. The justices will render their decision at a later date. The South Dakota Supreme Court is scheduled to hear more cases tomorrow. You'll be able to watch three of the cases live on Kelloland.com.